Here's a PC versus Mac comparison video you definitely won't see Linus, Austin, or Marquez do. And that is a test to see which formats a floppy disk faster. This Toshiba Satellite 105 CS introduced in February 1996 at a price of $1,999. Or this Apple Macintosh PowerBook 5300C introduced in August 1995 at a price of $3,900. Although to be fair, this one is the deluxe model with an active matrix LCD, which itself cost $1,000 extra compared to the passive matrix LCD, which this laptop has. The Toshiba has an Intel Pentium processor running at 75 megahertz with 40 megabytes of RAM. It's running Windows for Workgroups 3.11, which was still a factory option when this model was made in 1996 for those who were reluctant to adopt the brand new Windows 95. And the Mac has a PowerPC 603E processor running at 100 megahertz with 32 megabytes of RAM, and it's running Mac OS 8.1. For my first test, I'll be using these Primaris high density diskettes. It says IBM formatted, but I bulk erased these disks, so they're now totally blank. And then I'll try formatting these Polaroid double density diskettes, which are brand new in the box, never have been formatted, and did not come pre-formatted. And this will be an interesting comparison because while the PC formats these double density diskettes to 720K, the Macintosh formats them to 800K. Whereas with high density diskettes, both the PC and Mac format are 1.44 megabyte. So here is the first high density diskette, putting it into the Toshiba laptop, and then putting one into the Mac. Okay, we're ready to begin formatting the disks. And I'll try to push the button simultaneously on both machines. Three, two, one, go. You may be able to hear that the Mac is seeking the disk drive heads a lot faster than the PC, but that does not necessarily mean it'll finish formatting the disk faster than the PC. And now the Mac is verifying the format, so it does a second round, whereas the PC both formats and verifies in one pass. Oh, I think it's going to be close. We're now up to 93% on the PC while the Mac is leaving us in suspense as to when it's going to finish. And the PC is done, and... the Mac is done. It took a couple more seconds. I'll try to look at the video and figure out exactly how much longer it took, but maybe three or four seconds longer than the PC to format a 1.44 megabyte high-density diskette. And now for round two, formatting these Polaroid double density diskettes. Remember when diskettes used to come in individual sleeves? Every single one of these comes in its own little plastic sleeve. They don't do that anymore. Now we're ready to begin round two of the formatting test with the double density diskettes. And for this test, I set up an external microphone closer to the Macintosh so you can hear the interesting way it varies the speed of the floppy drive as it formats the diskette. So here we go. Three, two, one, go.
Wow, that wasn't even close. While the PC formatted the high density disk a couple seconds faster than the Mac, the Mac absolutely trounced it when it comes to formatting a double density diskette, even though it's formatting it to 800K, while the PC is only formatting it to 720K. And that's due to the variable speed system that these older Macs use on their 800K and 400K diskettes. Plus the Mac has something you won't see on any PC floppy drive and that is auto eject. So that's the PC versus Mac speed comparison test which nobody asked for and which is totally irrelevant but I think it's interesting. So thank you for watching. Three, two, one, go. What?